A Georgia man is accused of luring a 15 year old girl from Dilly to Florida. Dilly police say he'd been communicating with the teen online. He's since been arrested thanks to the help of multiple agencies. Investigators say this case highlights a bigger issue in the world of social media. He tells the night team's Jaffany Gray what parents and children can do to avoid online predators. Luckily, uh, we were able to get to the child to make sure the child was safe before any, any further harm could come to the child. This is the Mandilly police say lured the 15 year old girl, 38 year old Vincent Joseph Robusto of Georgia. Officer Adrian Ruiz says the convicted felon had been communicating with the teen through PlayStation and Snapchat. Five days prior to the girl's family notifying police, which was on the 22nd, she was supposed to be in an all inclusive church camp. Instead, this individual boarded a plane out of San Antonio International and landed in Florida and met this person. Now, what we don't know yet is whether she knew this person to be the person they were claiming or if they were claiming to be somebody else. Ruiz says at first the family was not worried that the teen was not communicating with them, but red flags went up while tracking her location. When they started noticing that she was at a residence and she still wasn't replying, um, that's when they began to get a little worried. In collaboration with the Charlotte County Sheriff's Office, officials found both Robusto and the girl in a home in Port Charlotte. She's now back in Texas safely with her family. Robusto in the Charlotte County Jail facing five criminal charges, including imprisonment of a person against their will, possession of drug paraphernalia, delivery to a minor, and interference with child custody of a minor. Dilly police now raising awareness to parents to be involved with everything their child is doing, especially in today's age of modern technology. If they have a camera, if it has internet access, and if it has a microphone, your child could be a target. Again, Ruiz is urging all parents to always know who your children are communicating with and where they're located at all times. And for children, if you're ever online and you feel uncomfortable about someone trying to make contact with you, report them. Jaffney Gray, KSAT 12 News.